welcome this is the energy vibration reading for the Aquarians um, Sun Moon and Rising sign I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for these wonderful positive support that you have been given to me um, this is the second week of December 2017 and the week begins from the 11th of December until the 17th of December okay from the 11th until the 17th so I want to say to each and every person out there um, please remember to listen to your Sun Moon and Rising sign and please um, support this channel by um, sharing these videos and thumbs up like and shares okay um it's going to be a wonderful week but for you guys um please be you know it's a it's a week of the chariot so there's going to be a lot of movement a lot of changes not only that the ch energy of the chariot where you have the zodiac energy of the fire you are an air sign so you have to be um very very vigilant in this week okay let's see um what we have here for you guys in this week you have the energy of the five of swords the energy of the five of swords this energy of the five of swords it is um, conflicts so you'll be having conflicts with other people um, sometimes these conflicts that are coming up it is just um, if you don't have conflicts you can clear and end situation in your lives okay so these conflicts are coming up to let you know that it is time to end a certain situation in your life and to move forward and to move away out of a um, certain situation that doesn't serve you anymore okay so your week begin with the energy of the world and and um, the energy for the men because this is a balanced week of both masculine and feminine the energy of the men is in the reverse form you have the four of cups some people will be feeling burdensome some people will be feeling as if they have lost something but the nine of cups comes on Thursday so Thursday is going to be a very very good day for you on Friday you have the Knight of Wands. The Knight of Wands is someone who's an Aquarius, a gem, Aquarius, a Libra, and a Leo of a Sagittarius. Okay, so whatever and whoever that person is, um, we're going to see what effect and what are they bringing in your life. On Saturday, um, a wonderful energy, the Ace of One, a new beginning. Um, Saturday you are having a new beginning on Sunday you have the seven of Pentacles in reverse so whatever your financial situation is of was you are going to see that it's going to be um, happening and um, this is going to be changing a lot of stuff okay so um, I'm looking at whatever extras are here you have the energy of number four so calling in the angels and the guides there's a lot of doubles that are coming out a lot of doubles that are coming out so let's see conflict so um your energy vibration number is going to be the number five okay so a lot of you have conflicts with the king of cups so the king of cups is an Pisces um, the king of cups is a Pisces a cancer or a um, Pisces a cancer or a scorpion okay a lot of you are having conflicts with this person so let's look and let's see exactly what is happening as you see the week we have on Monday an energy of transformation. This energy of transformation bring forth the world. Whatever that has been transpiring, whether in your work, your life, your whole life, your whole being, this energy of the transformation, there is a huge transformation that is happening and the energy of the world is going to happen so whatever is ending something better is about to begin it because the energy of the world is positive situation positive energies that is affecting you so this is going to be wonderful and positive okay so 
whatever is happening whatever is ending um, it's going to bring forth something good for the men you have the energy of the eight of wands for a lot of you men um, you have been waiting for information especially Tuesday is a good day for the ladies but for the men it's going to be a day where um, your energy vibration is off okay and for the women you're going to be receiving a lot of messages and um, a lot of information coming at you and a lot of messages and a lot of good situations for the men you'll be receiving these messages but your energy is so off in this week so let's see why your energy is so off and what exactly is happening because for the women um, you women Tuesday is going to be a good day number five energy is going to play a significant role in your life okay so let's see what is happening for you men um, what is happening is that um, there is going to be a theft that is going to happen because you you know with the situation you are having the energy and this these two together are wonderful for some men you're going to have a situation with your kids and I have to do with money and it's as if you have to give out a lot of money for some men you're going to realize that your business there is situation that something was stolen this situation is a new beginning with money it can be stolen for some people but it could be for some people that there's a situation that is happening that is affecting you and a child there is a situation that has to do with money that is affecting and it could be theft or it could be that you have to give out more on an organization or something that is happening in your life so be aware of this be aware look and see what is affecting you because for some men you're going to realize that you have to pay pay something because it's as if you have done something injustice and you didn't want to pay and now you really have to make that payment because it's as if the law said you have to do this so you men is as if something had transpired and you didn't want to pay and you have to pay but for the women it's going to be good be careful of what is happening um, for the women um, for the women whatever whatever that has transpired whether your energy whether your physical materialistic things and that has to do with money there's going to be a new start and there's going to be a change that is going to come in for you if you needed money for the um, to um, for support for your kids and that sort of a thing you women it's going to come in um, whatever money you needed to support your kids or from institutes and organization that you are looking for it will happen for the ladies for the men it's going to be in the reverse form just like this okay as we look forward we are looking at the middle of the week you have the energy of the number four you guys have the energy of number four and number five so a lot of changes will be coming in and a lot of people will be having stability the energy of this week is whatever is happening your financial situation will be balanced and with inner strength you are going to make it through whatever financial imbalance that you have I'm sorry let me hold these cards much better okay and then what is going to happen is that you're going to have a very strong foundation this energy with the energy of the four of cups some people are going to be having regrets and thinking I wish and this is coming to the end of the year so some people are going to have a situation where um, their jobs their contracts isn't extended and that sort of a thing but not to worry you're going to find the inner strength and you will have uh, the money so hold on to your money don't give out too much um, for gifts in this week because you never know what the new year is about to bring for you guys okay as we move on we're looking at Thursday a wonderful day you have the energy of the nine of cups 
um, whoever that was affecting you the enemies people who were working against you people who were trying um, to make um, your life difficulty they are now in the reverse form the energy of the ten of Pentacles is coming up and this is going to be extremely extremely wonderful for you Aquarians okay so not to worry about money and if you look the two energy of these money cards you have the four the four of Pentacles and you have the ten of Pentacles so Thursday is going to be a good day for most of you let's look at the energy on Friday you have the energy of the Knight of Wands whoever this person is you have a conflict so some people have a conflict with uh, the um, with the King of Cups and some people have a conflict with the Knight and the King of Cups is a Pisces a Cancer or a Scorpion and some people on Friday is going to have a situation with somebody who is a Leo um, a Sagittarian or a Aries okay and there is going to be a conflict and that's going to be on Friday okay so this is good let's see what we have on Saturdays for you guys on Saturdays you have a new beginning and if you were in a relationship with someone who is hey if you were in a new relationship with someone who is a um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn guy or woman there is going to be a new start for you guys this is going to be very positive this is going to be a positive situation for some people it is the same money it's on is on its way um, it's coming to you but very slowly and this new beginning is going to bring you um, really um, money and it is a new beginning for some people with someone who is between the ages of 25 and 40 and this and maybe 45 and this person is going to bring you balance in your life okay let's see what else this person is bringing yes so for you women obviously it's a relationship it's a new beginning in a relationship for a lot of you women and if you are coupled with the energy of um, um, a guy who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn you're going to see this happening and playing out for you because there's going to be a new beginning so on Saturday maybe you receive a message that he's inviting you out let's look at Sunday you have the energy of the seven of Pentacles so there is no worries about money whatever you are doing keep on doing it because the energy of the magician comes in to say just go on just keep on doing whatever you're doing because um, you are seeing that uh, um, whatever you're doing is going you're you know it's as if whatever you're doing it's it's especially if you have your own business and if you are working for people whatever you're doing it's going to bring you success because it's going to um, bring money in um, and just keep on doing whatever you are doing okay just keep on doing whatever you're doing so let's recap your week conflicts and these conflicts have to do with the um, king of cups this conflict is with someone who is a Pisces, a Cancer, or a Scorpion. So look around you. This is someone who is 40 and older. So look around you to see what is happening here. So let's uncap your week. The first half of your week um, for the men, it's not going to be on Tuesday. It's not really one of those positive days, but for the women, it is. Okay. Saturday is going to bring in positive energies because if you're in a relationship especially for the women there's going to be a new beginning for the women for the women between the ages of, of 25 and 45 you are going to have this positive new beginning with someone who is a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn and this is going to be very wonderful this is going to be very positive as we move on and we're looking at uh, um, 
the the crowning of your week the crowning of your week as you can see you have the energy of the four of cups and you have inner strength and you have the four of pentacles which is very good so you have the energy of the four of cups and this is emotional situation and you're finding you're trying to find um inner inner strength to balance this out okay so you have two fours um you're trying to balance out your emotional self but you're trying to balance out your your materialistic your um materialistic world okay so uh, this week is going to be an energy of you trying to balance out your materialistic world and this is going to be good okay so as we look at thursday remember that thursday is going to be um your very best days for um most of the men but this is going to affect the men and the women some men and some women because thursday is going to bring a positive happiness um over um overpowering your enemies and by doing that money is going to come to you okay so whatever that people have tried to do against you or that sort of a thing block your financial thing it's going to be okay friday remember some of you are going to have conflicts with someone who is a leo a, um, a sagittarian or an aries okay and this conflicts is going to happen so on Sunday no matter what is going on if you have your own business or that sort of a thing understand that it is going to all work out for you guys I am working and doing something different this week because it's Christmas I love December it's one of my favorite months and I'm using the good talk and let's see what is the message that the good tarot have for you aquarians sun moon and rising aquarians what do they have for you the queen of fire they have the energy of the queen of fire for you the energy of the queen of fire so this energy of this queen of fire is that they wants you to adopt the energy of the queen of fire and what is going to happen for some of you who have um the Aquarian who have um, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarians in your birth chart, you are going to feel this week the most. Okay, so let's see what message the angel answers. So, whatever messages, whatever questions you have for yourself in this um, second week of December for you, Aquarians, this is the answer compromise compromise so whatever is going around going on around you compromise okay compromise so ladies and gentlemen um i want to say to you guys um it is the second it is the second of uh, um december um uh, this is a weird year <laughs> and um it's whatever is happening it's going to be positive it's going to be good so i'm saying bye until next time